for many years of injustices and conflicts through the Bangsamoro Organic Law that was recently ratified via a plebiscite last January 21, 2019, the vision of representing the Filipino Muslims' right to identity came into fruition. The Bangsamoro Autonomous Region in Muslim Mindanao was formed. It has risen the idea of an autonomous region for the Bangsamoro, wherein its people will be given autonomy to govern a more culturally sensitive state for themselves. The challenges faced by the Bangsamoro is multifaceted. In the education sector, in the BARMM, one problem is the low quality of basic education. The consequent challenges are limited access to higher education, low student performance in aptitude tests and academic examinations, low literacy rates, and critical literacy. Another challenge is the misunderstandings and conflicts between different faith traditions and cultures in the Bangsamoro. Its consequent challenges are considerable probability of violence among Muslims and non-Muslims, higher susceptibility to economic instability, and high risk of political instability. These are the current social conditions that the Madaris Volunteer Program seeks to solve. The Madaris Volunteer Program is an initiative of the Catholic Education Association of the Philippines. In partnership with the National Association for Bangsamoro Education Incorporated and implemented by the Ateneo de Davao University, the Madaris Volunteers serve the community of the BARMM whose literacy rate consistently ranks as the lowest in the Philippines. Currently, the Madaris Volunteer Program has 26 partner Madaris in the cities of Cotabato, Sabuanga, and Marawi, and in the provinces of Maguindanao, Pasilan, Tawi-Tawi, Sulu, and Davao Oriental. These partner Madaris are recipients of our volunteer teacher deployment. That's why I uh, volunteer because um, gusto ko matulungan yung mga tao sa Mindanao um, na magkaroon sila ng hope sa sarili nila. The program sends able-bodied and psychologically fit volunteer teachers to partner Bangsamoro communities to teach DepEd mandated basic education subjects. They will be deployed for one school year and will be hosted by a Muslim family living in the community. Volunteers will also immerse in inter-religious and intercultural dialogue, capability enhancement trainings. What makes this uh, capacity building uh, training very special to me is um, how it has changed me, more specifically how my perception of our brothers and sisters in our Muslim communities um, have uh, debunked my impressions, my negative impressions, my biases about them, and the most practical way to move from awareness to action is by implementing interreligious dialogue, frameworks, and strategies, and approaches, and pedagogies inside the classroom. Each year, identified partner Madaris are recipients of trainings facilitated in partnership with schools from the Catholic Educational Association of the Philippines. Peace and focusing. But sa akin, the meaning of peace to connect the other religion. The Madaris Volunteer Program's motto is peace building through education. The program emphasizes on the need to understand and to engage in Filipino Muslim culture as a vital ingredient to achieving peace in the Bangsamoro. The short term goals of the MVP are immediately evident every after an event or an entire batch of immersion from the volunteers. There is an openness from both the volunteers and the Madaris community members that is inherently palpable. Their outlook becomes more sensitive and compassionate, so much so that talks of differences and divisions are replaced by solidarity and fellowship.